Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Megan, and if you are new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. Go and try your luck. Test me in again. We let it rain. Please don't start us up. Got that black and white, that yin and yang. Mr. Officer, please don't search us. We don't got a thing. Tell her park it up. Then that ass be parking. Today's video I'm super, super excited about because I'm going to be sharing with you my favorite edge controls. Now, edge controls, I definitely look for some things in an edge control, so I'll be sharing with you all of that. But before we get started, if you are new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I upload videos every Wednesday and Sunday, and normally I do not sound like this, but I am under the weather. <laughs> And I actually just started feeling much better, but my voice is still a little raspy, so please, please, please do not click out the video. I normally do not sound like this, and hopefully by next week, I'll be back. So for edge controls, I look for hold, I look for minimal residue, I look for the smell, and I just look for the overall feel of the edge control. I have definitely been through my fair share of edge controls and some of them were straight flops, and then there's some that were just thebomb.com. Well, today I'm gonna be sharing with you thebomb.com edge controls. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and talk about the ones I absolutely love. So the first one I'm gonna talk about is, of course, my Eden Body Works edge control. I have been using this one for a very, very, very long time. This one has been with me since day one. So like when I first went natural, I was looking for edge controls and then ran across this one and I just absolutely love it. Like with any edge control, you're going to get residue, especially if you continue to apply edge control over and over and over on your edges. Let me just get that out there. That's because, you know, as it cake, it's going to cake up and eventually get residue. So every now and then I'll wash my just my edges and that way it definitely reduces the flaking whenever you're applying on a daily basis like myself. So yes, I absolutely love it. The texture of it, it's like a glaze and it's nice and thick and it just holds down your girls curly edges. Now, another thing about this, it smells like coconut, it smells like their signature products, and I absolutely love it. This is more like a springy edge control, like it's like bouncy, definitely does give a great amount of shine. So yeah, I absolutely love it. Definitely a must try. So this next edge control definitely surprised me because I had was about to just like throw the whole line of me. In previous videos, I have talked about Buy Me Beautiful and how I just absolutely hated their shampoo and conditioner. Well, <laughs> they do have something I do like. And I've been having this in my stash for quite some time. And one day I was like, I ran out of edge control and I was like, let me go ahead and try it out. Let's see how it works. And to my surprise, y'all, this stuff works good. Like, what? With a T. So it is very similar to Eden Body Works. It's like a bouncy glaze and it smells really good. It doesn't have like a very potent smell. It smells kind of like their line. Almost like a faint tropical fruity smell. Not bad at all. Very, very minimal residue, which I was like shocked. And another thing is it gives your edges a nice, good shine. So the hold is there, the shine is there. I just love it. Like, I was shocked because I was about to throw the whole line away. Shampoo, conditioner was trash, but this made up for it. All right, so this next one, I was very late to the party and I was mad that I was very late to the party. And I mentioned this is my favorites in 2019. The products I was taking with me to 2020, well definitely, definitely took it. But I was very mad that I was late to the party. I was like, why none of my natural friends, my besties didn't tell me about this sooner? This is the Salt Factor Edge Booster. And this comes in different colors. It comes in different um, smells. I just decided to get this one. This is their extra strength rich pomade for thick and coarse hair and it's for a maximum hold. It also says that it has lasting shape, style, and shine for thick and coarse hair. And let me tell you, baby, <laughs> this definitely does the trick. 
Okay, so what I will say is this one does give slightly a bit more residue than the others, but as long as I clean my edges, it's more like an everyday thing so I won't get any residue. If I do three days with this and don't clean my edges, then yes, you will get residue. So highly suggest cleaning your edges. And what I mean by cleaning your edges is just taking some water and just like, you know, cleaning off that edge control because the more and more you cake on it, the more residue and flakes you're going to get. But this hold is definitely hold. Like when it says for coarse and thick hair, they was talking about me. <laughs> and so I think, did I use this one today? Yes, I did use this one today and it slicked my edges down and my hair was like, whoa. Like I should have done a before and after, but my hair was very bad and this definitely slicked it down. I've been using this faithfully and I absolutely love it. Now the next one, I'm kind of embarrassed to show y'all because it's been through some stuff, but <laughs> it is the got to be glue. Now, what I will say is this, I do use this as an edge control is it the safest product? Probably not. Um, I did hear that the ingredients are trash, but it definitely holds your girl's edges down. Okay, so this right here is like, this really was helpful when I lost my edges. And so for those of you that have lost your edges, you know what I'm talking about. When you try to like hide that you've lost your edges, and I'm not saying like lost all your edges, but like where you're balding, well this stuff, help kind of hide it like it made it really slick back and so therefore you really couldn't tell that I had lost your, my edges but yeah I really enjoyed using this and I mean I know it's not the best ingredients but just like it says got to be glue is glue this oh it's just so gross I'm just embarrassed to even show y'all but this is what it looks like it looks like glue like for real for real but it's been through some things. And the last edge control that I absolutely love and I had to bring it on the channel is the My L Honey and Ginger Edge Control. Now, I was kind of leery about bringing this on my channel because of the fact of how My L handled a certain situation previously this year. And I was just like, I just wasn't, I didn't really like the way they handled the situation. And as a brand, I just felt like they could have done way better. However, I had purchased this before the whole thing came out. And so yes, I did have to include it into my top phase. Will I be repurchasing? I probably will not be repurchasing. I just feel like them as a brand, they could have handled the situation much better. But what I do love about this, I love the smell. I love the way it feels on my hair. It also doesn't leave that gross residue. So it definitely had to go into my top phase. So those are my top five edge controls that I absolutely love. Those are the ones that I can honestly say do a doggone good job. One of my faves, Ambition Rice did a edge control challenge. And if so if you're interested in seeing that on my channel, I would definitely like to bring it to y'all. She did an amazing job. And so I was like, oh, that's a, that was a very neat idea. So if you want to see like the battle of the edge controls, then definitely leave me a comment down below and I can get some others that I can try and we can just battle them out. Well guys, it's been real. Don't forget to hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.